We're going to freeze dry some bananas. Check it out. First peel them all and then make sure you remove all the little stringy things. We've taken a few different approaches to cutting the bananas, but this mandolin slicer really makes quick work of it. We can cut four at once into really consistently sized slices, and surprisingly, it doesn't get too gunked up. All in all, it probably took about 10 minutes to cut up all 48 bananas using the slicer. Coating them in lemon juice is optional, but it does help to keep them from browning before they freeze. We're sticking these straight into the machine instead of pre-freezing, so we went ahead and did the lemon juice. The lemon juice does make these much more wet, so they will take longer than without the juice, so just take that into consideration if time is a factor for you. If you want the machine to run faster, you can stack them next to each other individually. You can run multiple layers per tray by separating them with parchment paper. We're not in a hurry, so we just kind of toss them on the tray. It gets the job done. One eternity later. Here we have it, beautifully unbrowned, freeze-dried bananas. The only real problem with just tossing them on the tray like we did is that they stick together. It's not really a big deal if you're just making treats for your kids, but it's really not as nice if you're trying to sell them to people. You use mason jars for short-term and mylar bags for long-term storage. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe for more freeze-dried videos.